Hey guys, I'm gonna make a quick side dish. I'm gonna make some fried corn. So I'm gonna show you our ingredients so we can get started. Okay guys, right here you have the corn. This is frozen corn. You can use fresh. Um, just take the fresh and you would cut it off the ear or you can use can. If you use the can, make sure you drain the can, um, but I'm using the frozen. This right here, this is some green onions. This is the tops. I took a whole a um, bunch of green onions and I just cut the tops up and chopped them up into um, round pieces. Right here is some smoked turkey sausage. You can use beef, chicken, or bacon. Use Traditionally people use bacon, but I'm using the smoked turkey. That's why I have the olive um, oil to render a little bit of the fat um, out of the sausage because it's not a lot of fat in the turkey sausage, so I did add some olive oil. Right here is some seasoning salt. This is some smoked paprika, paprika. <laughs> and right here, you have some black pepper. So let's get you over to this pan and we can get started. All right, I'm gonna add the olive oil. And I say that's about a tablespoon, maybe, maybe a little bit over a tablespoon, but not too much. I was just gonna use the olive oil, but I think I want a little bit of butter taste to it. So I'm gonna add a little bit of butter and to the olive oil. And when I, I usually add the butter, I do add the oil first to keep the butter from burning. That's one thing you should do. If you're gonna add um, butter to keep your butter from burning, add it to a little bit of like olive oil or grapeseed oil or canola oil, whatever kind of oil that you're using. And then I'm gonna add um, this smoked uh, turkey, turkey sausage. And I'm just gonna saute this for a few minutes before I add the onions. Now you see how the sausage is starting to get brown. Okay. Been cooking for probably about, um, about five minutes. So that's when you're gonna add your, um, your onions. Now, if you want to make this a vegetarian meal, you can omit the sauces entirely. You could just um, start off by sauteing your onions if you want it to be a veggie meal. So I'm going to cook this for a couple more minutes, and then I'm going to add the corn. Okay, I've been sauteing the onions and the uh, sausage for about two, two additional minutes, so... I'm going to add the corn now. I don't know how much corn. I think it's about 16 ounces. You add whatever you need for your family. I think I think it is about. It's either 12 or 16 ounces. I can't remember what that packet said. Because I had unfolded it and uh, put it in the refrigerator in a bowl. Now I am going to add the black pepper, the seasoning salt. And be careful with your salt that you're going to add because usually the meat, like your bacon or your sausage, whatever, they, they have a lot of salt in them, so you don't want it to be overly salty. But to give it that additional um, smoky flavor, that's why I got the uh, smoked paprika. That's another thing you can do. When you want it to have a little additional smoky flavor, you can add, you know, your spices that have the smoke flavor. And like I have some smoked salt that adds a, you know, good smoky flavor to it. So I'm going to let this hang out for a few minutes because you want to get those little brown specks on your corn. So I'm going to let that uh, sit there for about a couple minutes and then I'll stir it up and let you see it when I come back. All right, it's been cooking for about five minutes. See what we got. Yep. See how it has those brown bits on the bottom? That's what you want. That's flavor. So I'm going to stir this up and do it one more time. So let me get all that mixed up. And I'll let it hang out for like five more minutes. And then we'll have a side dish.
All right. There you go. This is a quick side dish. Good with chicken, beef, pork, anything. It took about 10-15 minutes. Alright, you guys try this recipe. You guys have a great day.